my lane fast, call it high speed I've been working hard, yeah, I've been working nightly If you think you'll win, ha, not fucking likely I be taking shots, yeah, cold-blooded, icy Watching numbers grow is what I call sightseeing In the front row, run it up when they hype me What's up, freaks? Welcome to Steve Says, episode number 122 Now, this week... If you see up in the headlines, I have a confession to make that I am soft. And I'm going to explain that for you here in a second. I am fucking soft. No way around it. I have to admit it. I'm soft. So, but first, I want to I want to just tell you really quickly what Steve says is all about. As you know, each week this is not always what you want to hear, but the shit that you need to hear. Some people will hate, but most can relate. We are bringing the freaking fire every Second of every second, Steve Says is a live show on how to have a no excuses, badass mindset guiding you to adapt, overcome, and destroy the obstacles that are preventing your success in your health, your family, your finances, your fitness, so you can stop being a little bitch, get your shit together, and start living life on your own freak terms. We're focusing on the mind, the body, the business, on how to have a role model mindset, how to operate to dominate with Discipline, energy, confidence, action, being your freak motherfucking self. That's what we're talking about. So, I'm soft. I told you I'm soft. Let's talk about it. Now, I want to t- tell you what I mean by that. First off, do you have do you have soft skills? And they're on all these different screens here. I don't know what's up with that. Anyway, do you have soft skills? I just have you on something's up with one of these things, the Instagrams. There we go. And what soft skills are you lacking? And you're saying, wait a minute, why would I want to be soft? Why the hell would I want to be soft? Well, I'm gonna break that down for you. You wanna know what soft skills are? Being soft is what's considered so a hard skill. Let's say most people think when it comes down to it, they need to learn or or get a new sales script to sell more. Or they think they need the next new marketing funnel. Or in a gym, they think they need the next new piece of equipment. Or the next program. The next, the next funnel that's going to take them to the next level. And often, as, as I've dealt with now thousands of, of men all, from all around the world and all the different coaching programs and the project in our LTD, leadership and team development training and one-on-one OTD coaching, all across the board, it usually, people come to you for what they think they need or what they with what they want and you give them what they fucking need. They think that what they need is a new sales funnel or some marketing help. And that's never what they need. That's never what they need. Someone asked me the other day. They said, "What what can I do for more lead generation?" I said, you don't have a lead generation after after just a few simple questions and hearing the tonality and the body language and all this. So you don't have a fucking lead generation problem. You have a leading problem. Learn to lead. Learn to lead yourself. Learn to lead others. Learn to lead your fucking day. That's a soft skill. Leadership, make no mistake, is a soft fucking skill. So yes, I am training and trying to be softer when it comes to these skills. L- listen, having discipline is a soft skill. Energy, decisiveness, self-awareness, motivation, inspiration, enthusiasm, encouragement, and productivity. These are soft skills. But people think they need the new the new app that's going to help them to be more productive. But what they need is training on productivity, training on how to manage their emotions, manage manage their energy. These are soft skills. Productivity is a soft fucking skill. Leadership, discipline, and these are things that people need. They think they need these shiny objects up here, but what they need are the fucking soft skills. These are all soft skills. I don't know why they're called soft skills. I call them hard fucking disciplines. That's what I call them. Think about it. How is productivity fucking soft? How is enthusiasm or energy or encouragement or awareness or leadership, decisiveness, how is that, that, that soft? Motivation, inspiration. Okay, because, yeah, you can't just motivate someone and, and motivation is not going to help them pay the bills and all this other stuff. No, but if you help someone get their shit together to lead themselves, have those daily disciplines, daily habits, 
and to beat the fucking drum so they could have their beats going on, good days, bad days, no matter what. That's a soft fucking skill. That's real productivity. Productivity is getting more done in less time. More excellent work done in less time so you have more time to do the shit that you really want to do. So it's about getting, getting, letting people think they're getting what they want but really giving what they, what they fucking need. People need more of these soft skills. And I'm, I'm done calling them fucking soft skills. These are hard motherfucking disciplines. So what most people need are hard motherfucking disciplines. Because they're called soft skills, but they ain't fucking soft and they ain't freaking easy either. Leadership ain't easy. Productivity ain't necessarily easy. Getting motivated for most people is not easy. All this stuff is, uh, or or time management or whatever you want to fucking call it, work-life balance. We've gone through all this. Time management is not a time management problem. You don't have a time management problem. You don't need a new app or a new calendar or a new wall thing or whatever for, for, for your time management. You have an energy management problem, you have a boundaries problem, and you have a fucking you problem is what you have. And those are soft skills. That's what they are. There's nothing fucking soft about them. That's just the way it is. And really, most most businesses that, uh, that I've, I've come across, they think they need the next uh, competitive advantage course and app and program, and technology, and yeah, that stuff might help, but usually what it is, is a problem with a culture, problem with having a healthy fucking team, they've done, they've done studies that, that people wouldn't use a, a company's services if they thought their employees didn't care, or were just indifferent about it, more, that ranked higher on why someone will not use a company service, more than a poor product or service, like, those are soft skills. Leading the team is soft skills. Creating a, a healthy fucking team, healthy culture, healthy you, healthy leadership. And we're talking about healthy in your fitness, your, dis- your discipline, your ha- daily habits, your routines. These are freaking soft skills. Marine Corps leadership. Every, there are 14 Marine Corps leadership traits. Every one of them is a fucking soft skill. A soft skill. Which is why... I would call them fucking hard disciplines. It's Marine Corps leadership principles, leadership traits and principles and core values, leadership objectives. Nothing fucking soft about it. Nothing soft about it at all. Usually what's missing are these so-called soft skills. They make the hard skills come easy, even automatic. You lead yourself. You do the shit you're supposed to be doing on a daily basis. You get the beats of your fucking drum nonstop, and good things will happen. Shit, you will get growth in all those other areas of life that you think you need the thing, but you really need the thing, the foundation, the thing, the fucking you. That's what you need. You need to, most of the time don't need uh, to learn new the new sales scripts or get a copywriter or video editors or any of that, you, you could use that stuff eventually. Sure, that's only going to help you get even better eventually. But that's not the first thing you need. First thing you need to do is stop being a little bitch. Getting over your fear and doubt and procrastination. Having some confidence. And yes, you could be trained and coached in fucking confidence. And being an action taker. A risk taker. A bold move motherfucking maker. You can be taught and helped and coached. And, and have guidance and mentorship in these, in these soft areas. In communication which is part of setting boundaries, which will lead to productivity, which will lead to you generating and protecting your own damn energy, which means generating and protecting your own damn life. These are the soft skills that you freaking need. You think you need all this other stuff, and you're always wondering, you're always looking and scraping for what's missing. What's missing is you're not sticking to the basics and fundamentals. It's the basics and fundamentals that win the fucking war. The basics and fundamentals win the war. Stop looking for that extra thing, that outside freaking external source. It's right there. Every bit you need is right fucking there. The discipline, the energy, the confidence, being the action taker, being your freak motherfucking self. When it comes to combat, the the side that wins is not necessarily the army that has the bigger force, the greater technology, the more tanks. It's the side that sticks to the basics and fundamentals consistently over time through chaos through craziness, through change. And there's just unwavering, relentless. The basics and fundamentals win the fucking war. You're training to shoot your gun. Training to shoot your rifle. 
all the time to breathe, control your breathing, smooth trigger control, shoot straight when you're training, when you're practicing, and then war comes and you start shooting all over the fucking place, and you lose, go to shit, lose all the basic fundamentals, you will lose the war no matter how many fucking people you have if you don't stick to the basics and fundamentals. The reason why we do the basics and fundamentals, the reason why we train those basics, the reason why we train to shoot straight in training and in peacetime is so that we will shoot straight in fucking wartime. Not so we'll lose our shit. Lose control of your freaking emotions. It's those soft skills that are going to get you there. Those daily disciplines that seem like it's it's not something that's coachable, not something that's learnable, not something that's you can be mentored on, but absolutely you can. And you can even make monetize it, you make a, a business out of it, create a business out of it. That's from co- most coaching, 99% of coaching. I'll get people that will hire me to be a business coach, and you know how much, how much time we actually have to spend on the business? 20% max, and that's the high end. That's the fucking high end. It's the 80% of all the other shit. But you know what happens? The business explodes. The business makes a shitload of more money as a byproduct of that 80% of other shit that they needed to work on. That they needed to work on. The you they needed to fucking work on. The soft skills they needed to work on. The discipline. The energy. The confidence. The decisiveness. The freaking motivation. Whatever the fuck you want to call it. The enthusiasm. The encouragement. The productivity. The time management. The energy management. The work-life synergy. They nail that shit down. You nail down the work-life synergy. You nail down the energy management, aka time management, aka work-life balance. You nail that shit down. Your lead generation fucking skyrockets. Holy shit, that's the greatest lead generation program I've ever seen. Sticking to the basics, the fundamentals, the shit, doing the shit on the easy days, the shit on the slow days, the doing the training and practice in peacetime. So you're ready because the invasion is coming. It's fucking here. And you're ready when the invasion comes. You're ready for the wartime because you just keep the beats down. You keep it going. The basics, fundamentals, those are all soft skills. They all will win the war. These soft skills or hard disciplines will win the fucking war. They will help you make more money. They will end up generating or creating momentum or creating those harder skills, creating that those profits, those sales funnels. Because if you have all the disciplines in all those other areas, it's going to give you so much extra time to either lead or delegate or create the fucking masterful excellence of execution in the sales funnel. Or the marketing campaign. Or the scripts or the emails or whatever the new shiny object that you think you need that's going to be your big breakthrough. The big fucking breakthrough is you, motherfucker. That's a big breakthrough. You and your soft skills, your hard disciplines, that's the breakthrough right fucking there. That's it. Quick. Short. And dirty this week. On Steve says, episode number 122. Work on your damn hard skills. Your hard disciplines. Your soft skills, so-called. Work on your soft skills. Become fucking soft. It will lead the way to all the success in all those areas that you're looking for in life. All those obstacles. All those roadblocks in your health. In your in your business. Your mind, your body, your business. Whatever roadblocks are there. It is the basic fundamentals, those soft fucking skills that will get you through as long as you're consistent day in, day out, no matter what the fuck goes on. Not letting that stuff be pushed aside on the hard days or the days you're getting attacked. doesn't make any fucking sense. You're training to fight the enemy. You're training to fight the enemy in peacetime. And then wartime happens and you abandon all the training and practice you did and you just go ape shit and fucking lose control of your shit. Lose control of your, your breathing when you're shooting. All this other stuff that you train for years and years and years for 99% of your time is training for the big show. You get to the big show and you lose all your shit. You abandon all the work, all the training, all the practice you did. It's fucking stupid. Tighten up your soft skills. Turn those soft skills into hard motherfucking disciplines. Into monetizable skills. Into money-making skills. Into impact-generating skills. That's what this is all about. Become a soft motherfucker. And on that note, in case no one told you yet today, you're fucking awesome. No excuses.